see the city in a whole different light. Back to you. Oh, that Thanks, Kathy. Looks great, it? doesn't it? Really, I'll go really have a look good. at it later, I think, Christy. Now, his best trick is combining impressive magic with funny banter. Those aren't my words. They're those <laughs> of a usually difficult to impress one Mr Ian Hislop about our next guest. Steve Faulkner from Sheffield has won the National Street Entertainer of the Year Award. We'll meet him in just a second or two, but first let's watch him in action on the streets of the Steel City. OK, so I'm going to start with something a bit naff and cheesy, because uh, this is what you expect a magician to do, so we'll get it out of the way. The, the thing is, everybody's seen the magician take the coin, make it disappear and come back, and all, all that kind of thing. So it's a bit of a weird thing where the coin actually falls up. <laughs> which is kind of weird, isn't it? <laughs> People think it's a magnet. Look, it's not, it's not. And this is quite... Because the thing with coin magic, it does get quite boring, OK? But it always comes... You've got to make it a bit interesting, so I'll finish off with something... <laughs> <laughs> I do a card trick. Just sign your name on the card, OK? It's where some people usually just put, please leave me alone, you tedious little man. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I know. OK, so we'll take the two. It's going to be very slow. I'm not going to try and confuse you with any quick movements. It's not about that. Really slowly, the card goes into the pack and just comes straight to the top. I'm actually amazed. Well, <laughs> hold the deck in case you think it's a dodgy pack of cards or anything, OK? So in the inside pocket, if I can get it out, is, 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 is the card. Hang on. Sorry, it's not. So I overshot. Sometimes it ends up. And this is an American wallet. It's got a little ID case in the wallet. Okay. You have to take the card out, turn it over, and show it to the, the camera and everybody. Um. Do you know <laughs> that is that is unbelievable. There you go. I actually got a shiver down my spine. Yeah. <laughs> I that effect on everything. Well, that's yeah, uh, Steve well. in action. Yeah, yeah, looks very good, Steve. Welcome to the, the programme. That okay. guy wasn't a plant there, was he? It was amazing, wasn't it? It was as <laughs> if he was. They were just so perfect. There was no-one around, and then these people just walked round the corner, and it was as if, oh, he was brilliant. You know, they I were loved, lovely, every lovely minute, yeah. loved every minute, loved every minute. You're not the usual street entertainer, you're not a mime artist, and mm. you're sort of... I suppose I'm used to seeing close-work magicianship, yeah. if there's such a word, at weddings and, and yeah. events like that. Yeah. But you do it out on the street. Well, I do. I mean, I do a lot of that as well now. And these days, you know, I'm getting a bit older and uh, feeling cold. cold a bit more. You know <laughs> what I mean? So, to be honest, a lot of my, most of my work now is corporate events. Um, I do weddings. Um, I do an after dinner show, which is based on my street show. And I think the street's a wonderful place to learn how to perform. And if with magic and juggling and all these things. They're great, but you've got to be able to perform and you've got to be likeable, and, and that's what the street teaches. You've always got an audience walking past, haven't you? That's the great thing about being there. Yeah, it's, it's just getting their them. attention. Yeah. You get a good reaction, presumably, from them as well, yeah. Yeah, I mean, you, you know, it's, if you go to York or Covent Garden, it's about, I mean, you've got to hold them for a good 40 minutes, and then the, the thing is, you've got to get them to pay after the show. That's always the tricky bit, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, and that's, that's the psychology and, and, the, and the performance skills. Really. Ian Hislop, notoriously difficult to impress, yeah. was extremely impressed. Yeah. Can you exp impress us, do you think, tonight? Have you got anything? Yeah, let's see you in shows? action. Hey? I'll give you a quick trick. OK, I'll give you... Um, cause obviously You'd have been disappointed if we'd not asked. <laughs> I know, I know. It's, uh, yeah, I'll just by chance, I have a deck of cards in it my It can't pocket. go wrong. This is live, you know. I know, I know. Yeah, thanks for letting me know. I was, <laughs> I was working on the fact that pretending it wasn't. But, uh, just take one of them. Um, go on, just, tell you just go for it. Okay, anyway, let's just try one card. There we go. OK. Okay, don't show it to me, obviously, it would make it all pointless, sure. or more pointless, depending on it. Can we show it to a camera? Yeah, show it to a camera, sign okay, your name on it. OK, we can show it to... Make sure I don't look. Don't look, don't <laughs> look, don't look. Don't I could look. have used that. OK. So yeah, look. I'm not going to patronise okay. you or the audience. You know how some tricks are done. I could have duplicate okay. cards hidden all over me. Uh, I go like this, you say stop. Stop. OK, put the card face down. OK, and it's got your name in it, so again, yes. no duplicate, but I know the card is a two of hearts. Is it not? No. Yeah. OK, OK, I don't know what it is. I'll take a guess. Sometimes I get it right. I've just walked... No, OK, I'm going to find it to say it would be tedious. OK. You really worried me, then. <laughs> I know, it's great. it's great to see the faces. I, like... I know, oh, I was getting it wrong in front this of all these people. No. Oh, well, no. <laughs> it's there on the front. You didn't really have to eat them. No. 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 <laughs> That's hideous. Your face is great. <laughs> I can't quite believe what's happening. No, I can't either. OK. Oh, it's full see, of there is a, It's not real, it's just an illusion. That's absolutely right. And, and there you go. That's the ten and, uh, of... Ten of spades. It's... I'm sorry if people were eating that's them. It's just an genuine. illusion. <laughs> there you go. There you go. And that's what I wrote on. There's your hideous souvenir.
Steve, impressive. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I thought it was all going horribly wrong. No, then. great. <laughs> Sounds like one of Paul's weathers, doesn't it? Going horribly wrong, but never yours, Lisa. If only you could do a magic <laughs> trick for the weather, because it's not looking nice yeah. at all. Before I bring you the forecast, though, let's look at some of tonight's photos, because the weather may have been uninspiring recently, but we have had some beautiful photos. This one taken near Tadcaster over the weekend, a beautiful.